A lot of people will put things on their social media just to kind of share what's going on. It says, first off, thank you everyone for your concern. I'm okay, just a little shaken up. Uh, I will be okay. For those of you who don't know what happened, I was robbed yesterday morning at a gas station. I gathered myself together. My hands are still shaking. Um, Dizzy, honestly, I think I'm in shock. My money was gone. I called the police. They were fantastic. I called for medical assistance. My blood pressure was through the roof. And um, the police asked me if I knew who did it. And I told him, yes, officer, it, w- it was pump number four. <laughs> I was so mad. Fast, I was so mad. Because it was like, I'm halfway through this thing going, oh, my God, I can't believe, where, where was this? And I'm, and it was like, yes, officer, it was pump number four. I'm like, okay, that's just wrong. I saw, that I saw is one yesterday wrong. With a guy in his robe and his slippers sitting in a lawn chair, those uh-huh. folding lawn chairs, saying, Gas prices are so high, I had to get rid of cable. Now I'll watch the news on the pump. Like, you know they have the free news channel? Like, <laughs> see, I guess you have to laugh about this. I mean, it, it, what else are you going to do? Cry? Well, we're also trying to, to help you to be as uh, as conservative with it as you possibly can with these gas-saving tips. <laughs> Helping to ease the pain at the pump, it's the gas-saving tip of the day. When you buy gas, pay cash. The price per gallon can be as much as 15 cents higher if you pay with a credit card. However, to safely transport that much legal tender, you'll need to trade in your pickup truck and drive a Brinks truck. (laughs) Yeah, really. Join us again (laughs) for another gas-saving tip of the day.